What's up guys? Welcome back to the Easy Mode Check Channel. We're here back again playing Skyward Sword. We're back here in the sky. Looks like there's another area we gotta head over to. So let's jump in. Master Mal, when you hit the Goddess Cube with the Skyward Strike earlier, I was able to detect a resulting energy reaction above the clouds. Oh. Location I've marked on your map indicates a spot where I sense an energy reaction. Okay. My guess is we're supposed to head there. Yep, I advise you to investigate the area around this location. Alright. We did... Oh, there it is. Okay. We made it. Is there anything up here? Oh, wait. There's a treasure chest. Yeah, I don't know why I can't open that. Okay. That's weird. It's all these pumpkins over here. Now I'm exhausted. random hole right there. Can't get bad at more rupees. You can always use those. I think there's one more. I don't know if it's gonna do anything. I was almost waiting for like in Breath of the Wild when you chop them down like this, there's an old man who comes out and gets mad at you. Like he's like, my bumpkins! <laughs> Well, I wonder if we need to, like... Well, I'm, like, wondering... Uh oh Okay, I was gonna try to capture that, but I guess... I guess you don't need it. Is there anything else over here? Let me look up. Okay, and it looks like just really pumpkins. Wondering though, am I gonna get anything for killing them all? For breaking them all? I don't think so. Okay, let's head inside. Unless there's something around here. I guess we wanna like look on all sides. Oh! Maybe this is what we're supposed to be here for. It's just this treasure chest. Now we have more room in our adventure pouch. Sick. Awesome. I think that's really the only reason we need to be here, right? I mean, like... I guess we can look around, but... I mean... Don't you think that was it? Let's go. Let's just check in here. Just in case, you know. See if there's any happenings. Oh, there's a heart up there. Kind of wanted that. Get that. Yeah, I, I want to try to get this heart up here. What's up, dude? Is this- wait. It's Stretch. Okay, I don't like this dude. Sure, what are you doing here, Stretch? I got mentioned this four man, I'm really into bugs. That's why I came to collect the insects whenever I find them. Oh, okay. If you don't have one, you can pick one up with beetles. Okay, so I guess we could have caught that bug outside. I was thinking about that. I kind of tried to get my jar out, you know, in hopes to, like, you know, catch the bug, but I guess not. And you can't use any of your weapons in here, which kind of sucks. If I'm honest, it's kind of dumb. Well, I'm like trying to look around and think like, okay, how could I get up to that to get the, like, if only I could, you know, shoot something. If I had my thing, I could shoot it, you know, but like, I think when you're in places like this, you're really not like supposed to use your sword. I can't even do it. Like I'm like trying to do it and it's not allowing me. What's in here? 
Oh, maybe this is like somewhere you can rest. No, I don't need to. I think if like you don't have, if you have low hearts, you can come in here and rest. What's this? Is this just outside? Oh, okay, wait. I didn't want to go outside. Okay, JK, go back. I don't want to go outside. Okay, let's talk to this guy. What's up? Welcome to every bird rider's favorite rest stop, Lummy Pumpkins, one of the only places you can enjoy some more famous pumpkin soup. Ooh, let's search, sure, let's try it. I am impressed, I can enjoy the refined taste. Fill it up. Okay, let's see. Oh, it's Pum's specialty, it'll get cold in five minutes. Okay, should I try it, I guess? Oh, wait. Let's try it. Let's drink it. I feel like nothing happened to me. Are you serious? Okay, that was, like, kind of dumb. Maybe I need to sleep until night and then... Believe what? If I sleep until night, maybe I can get up there and uh, get that heart up there. Okay, I guess there's like some creepy person up there or something. Let's talk to this lady. Hi. Welcome, I can see you're handsome. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, yes, okay, don't go thinking that you can get those down. You might think that you could knock the rupees down by bumping something and making the chandelier shake, but don't even think about it. Okay, what could I bump? Guys, what could I run into? There's gotta be something I could run into. That could make it shake. I'm gonna try it. Did that do anything? Did the chandelier shake? No. Oh, you know what? Look, it's hanging on this thing up here. What if I run into this? Dude. Okay. I have a theory. That kind of worked. That's sort of working. I'm wondering if I, need, if I need to try from this angle. Like, over here. Yeah, I can kind of get it more clear, like, over here, like, clear. There we go. Here we go, here we go. It fell off, but I'm gonna get the hearts and stuff, so I'll take it. He's kind of peeved at me, but I don't even care, dude. I'm gonna get this heart down here, and I'm gonna get all his money, so. Sorry, bro. I, I had to. I got a heart piece, so I needed it. He's gonna be mad at me. He's gonna be like, why would you do that? And I'm like, sorry, bro. I, I need the money. This dude gonna yell at me. Let's talk to him. Oh. What's wrong with you? Just look what you've done. You broke my fancy customer to chandelier. You're gonna be working me for free until you pay off every single rupee that the chandelier cost me. Ooh. I'm ready to own up. Let's do it. Ooh. Ooh, no. I have to deliver soup to Skyloft's Night Commander. That's annoying. Yeah, I think I'm ready. Let's do it. Okay, we gotta take the hot soup to him. Okay, where is this dude though? That's the thing. Where is the commander? 
That's like what I'm trying to figure out. I don't even know where this dude is. Am I gonna have to like leave and fly somewhere? Here, let me. I need a hint. Yeah, I don't know where the fetch this dude is. Okay, that was useless. Let me talk to the dude and find out where the fetch is this, like, commander. I'm assuming I have to fly somewhere. Don't you guys think? I mean, let me talk to him again. Where is he, dude? I don't even know. Okay. I'm going. I'm going, I promise. I'm trying. I'm assuming he's at Skyloft. Again, no. I really don't know how to fetch this guy. So I'm gonna jump off here and call my bird. There we go. Okay. I'm assuming he's somewhere here at Skyloft. What's this thing? It's probably where we're gonna go next, don't you think? Okay. Am I even going towards Skyloft? Oh no, I'm not. Skyloft is this way. Okay. Let's jump off my bird. Let's see, where would this dude be? Probably, don't you think, like, in the Night Academy? Okay, let's go there. If this is not where he is, I honestly don't know. Okay, no, dude, you're not who I need to deliver this to. No, no, no. Oh! I got a shield! I got my shield back, I forgot my shield broke. Dude, you're kinda wasting my time! Cool. Okay, thanks bro, thank you. I feel like he's gonna be in here. I think he's the dude who taught me like all this stuff. I think he's in here. Yeah, it is hitting this dude, okay. I did. I'm just gonna pretend lie so that I delivered to him. I think we got there within five minutes, so it should still be hot. It is, heck yeah, okay. Okay, I think we can go back now. First of all, let's... Okay, I'm ready, I think, to go back, and, uh, hopefully the dude's not peeved at us, but, who knows. Now I just need to find somewhere to jump off the edge so that my bird can catch me. Alright, let's get it! I keep forgetting these freaking jump. Here we go. I was like, my loft wing was not showing up, and I was like, well, we're gonna die. Alright. I think I have to go this way, but look at this. I'm, I'm like watching these, and I'm like, dude, should I try to like fly through this? Oh, dang it. Well, <laughs> I, I tried. Failed. Perfect. Okay, I think if we go back inside, um,. We should be good. The lumpy pumpkin. See, so you delivered the soup to Egus. I'm subtracting your pay from the bill for the chandelier. 
You're not done yet, I'm already- What? This game why I need you to text me, need you time to think about this, so come back and see me later. I- I think we're good to go then. I want to say the next objective then was head to some other area on the surface, but uh... So let's go there. Yeah, I want to say there's like another area that's open. Like, are we supposed to head here? Let's look at that. And that's what I'm thinking. I'm gonna try to fly through these little ho hoops. Cause I have this feeling that like they you get something if you do it. Like, I'm almost wondering. I gotta like time it just right. Oh no. I feel like I was flying fine and then we got close and something happened. Oh cool! It just makes you go fast. That's actually quite I feel like quite sped up my journey quite a lot. Okay, we need to go over to the goddess tower, which is over there, so let's, let's run. Darn, I probably shouldn't have swam, honestly, I'm, I think I'm like a slow swimmer. I should have probably stayed actually on my Skyloft uh, or my bird until I got to this area. I probably would have been smarter. But nonetheless, we'll get there. Oh yeah, you, someone was saying something about catching bugs. So I'm wondering like, is that gonna actually really affect my gameplay? I mean, I'm not thinking, I don't think it's like totally necessary, but maybe it is, who knows. Oh, there's a, there should be a stamina fruit right here, is there not? Yes. It's kind of too late to grab it, I was already pretty much recovered by the time I did that, but. Here we go. This is where I think we want to be. We're gonna go in here, place the tablet, open up a new area in the sky. Here we go. Yep. Master of confirm the location of the second opening. The cloud barrier is located in the skies to the northeast. Opening will allow you to access a new area of the surface. Suggest you fly there as soon as you complete necessary preparations. I say let's get the like bug net. Let's go visit the bazaar, see if there's anything else we want, you know. Oh, I guess we gotta fi help find somebody before we go to the surface. We're gonna find a kid. Oh. Mal, help us find this kid. Let's see. Perfect time, you haven't seen my kooky. I don't know. I'm gonna say, I don't even know. Kooky who? It's true. I see. Please, Mal, you won't you help me look for her? I've been looking for her everywhere, but I can't find her. Does everyone have to help find her? A few people have said she's spotted with some unknown person with a scary face. Someone else even said they thought she'd been carried off by a monster. A monster! She must have been kidnapped. She's cute and friendly. Someone must have walked off with her. It's very possible. Fine, Kukio. Please, please. Breaks my heart to think she's gone somewhere out there crying. All right, let's let's do it. We're pretty nice. Let's uh, let's help her out. Okay. I'm wondering if we can use dousing to like possibly. Hey! 
Like, it'd be kind of nice if we could target her. All right, let's, uh, let's go get her. I'm thinking we're going to need to talk to people around town. Kind of look around a little bit. So let's just kind of start, like, exploring a little bit, seeing if there's anyone we can talk to, find, give us some clues about kind of where she would be. Honestly, like, I'm not sure if we're just going to straight up find her, but, like, who knows? I don't know. What's over here? I know there's, like, the town, like, there's this area that has, like, the shops and stuff like this. So I feel like... There's gonna be more people around here. There's this chick. I guess we talked to her too. Did you hear, child? We've been playing in the graveyard on this. You believe it? Do you really think there are monsters abducting children in our little town? I don't know. Nothing faces you, child. Just vanished from our little village. I do remember the pumpkin place. Someone was saying something about that. If you could head over there. They might have some clues too. Maybe? I don't know. Let's, uh. Let's, let's jump off. Call my sky, loft, sky bird or whatever the fetch. And then maybe? I, I don't know. Like I feel like it's like... She said graveyard. I thought there's like a pumpkin graveyard. At this place. Let's try it. I'm gonna try to go on this thing again. Yeah, that thing's nice. Dang, it like super propels you. Like, I'm almost there. And it's been like two fetching seconds. Yeah, I pretty much died. That was not a good smart idea. Yeah, isn't there like a pumpkin graveyard here? I could have sworn there was. Like this, up here. It's considered a pumpkin graveyard. So it's like maybe she's chilling on this? I, I don't know. I think we already talked to these people earlier. You have that global look that says you might take an old man's rambling seriously, so tell me, do you believe in the Skyloft monster? Sure, I'll say yeah. Shouldn't even call it a monster. It's a demon, I tell you, but no one can say for sure because no one's seen it and lived to tell the tale. Huh, you want to know how come I'm telling the tale if nobody who's seen it is alive? Sure, I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, well, I saw, but I was able to escape by the seat of my pants. I was saved by my cat-like reflexes, I tell ya. Any regular person would have lo lived long enough to scream. Anyways, I saw the thing, I tell ya. There's a great big tree in the cemetery. I walked by the tree in the middle of the night. I saw it hit the gravestone nearest the tree. Okay. So, at night, we're gonna hit- I'm assuming we're gonna hit a gravestone nearest the tree. Push the gravestone and the door opened. Okay. This looks like this is where the kid's gonna be. Cemetery, middle of the night. Okay. Alright, looks like we're, that's where we're gonna, we're gonna head then. I thought the cemetery was here, but I guess not. Okay. Oh, I, I just realized, I was thinking, I was like, I think the graveyard was literally what, right where we just were. So I guess we could have just stayed there, but okay. Guess we'll have to wait till nighttime. So maybe we can find somewhere to sleep here and then wait till night and go to the graveyard. All right, let's see where Skyloft is. Over here. We're gonna fly through that thing again because it's freaking awesome and I love it. There we go. Yeah, this thing's sick. Honestly, it makes flying between these like so much freaking faster. So this is pretty awesome, I think. Okay, the graveyard I think is just over on this edge. So I'm just gonna like even. Oh, here we here it is. Okay, but we need to come here at night. That's the only thing. Is what it says. N night, and then we hit the stone closest to the tree. Is what it said. Something like that. Is what the guy said. So my thing is like maybe we need to go into the bazaar or whatever's over here sleep and then come back at night so let's find that place let's wait let's look real quick 
Yeah, here's the bazaar. I'm assuming in there is, uh, where are we? Yeah, we're close. And that's where we're gonna go to sleep, so let's do that. Okay. I think that's over here, is the entrance. Yeah, here we go. We'll sleep until night, and then this is where I think the girl is. All right. Uh, there's usually a place, like a hotel part, pretty much. Hi. No, okay, no. We don't want to do the item check. Okay, go away. Is this kind of what I'm looking for? Oh! Whoa, treasure. Tre it's kind of ones I've been seeing, but we can't been able to. Search for goddess cubes in the lands below and send them into the air. It's the only way to open these chests. Oh, that's why... Okay, that makes sense. So, like, I guess I can't open these. Okay. Well, that that's definitely something we're going to be able to have to look for. And we're down there as well. Okay, there's got to be a place to sleep in here, is there not? Isn't this what the whole point of the bazaar is? Okay, I already looked over there. Let's look over here. No, can I not sleep up here too, either? Is there anywhere to sleep in here? Did I just waste my time coming in here? I might have just wasted my time coming in here. Alright, well... I think we're just gonna have to go back to our bedroom. I'll go there, sleep till the night, and then I'll see you guys in the morning. Alright guys, it's night time! We made it here to the graveyard. We, all I know is that we need to hit the one closest to the tree. My guess is that's gonna be this guy, right here. So... Hit it and then- okay, yeah, hit it and then move it, and then... I guess we're going here next. Alright, what the fetch here? Oh, I need to- you know, I'm just gonna fall, I don't even care. Probably shouldn't have done that, I lost the life of heart, but... But not bad, let's look around. Oh, okay, we're going down here. Kind of a creepy path. Looking for this little girl. Hopefully we can find her fast. Ah! Oh, sounded like her. Looks like there's a spider we're gonna fight. Hopefully not. I freaking hated those spiders we fought earlier, so I'm hoping we won't have to. Oh no. It's the demon, but is it actually demon? I bet it's... Oh, it's a freaky... Oh! What is that thing? Oh! I thought he was gonna be evil. Okay, just kidding. I sure? I mean, you know, part harm, we're just playing. Scream as loud as you can, game. Isn't that a fun game? Oh dear, perhaps an explanation's in order. My name is... Batro? I'm a monster who resides here in the humble dwelling below Skyloft. Please allow me to correct one popular misconception. Well, I'm certainly a monster and wouldn't dream of terrorizing the people of this town. You see, this adorable little girl is the only one who didn't let loose a blood-curling scream at the sight of me. Since she began to visit me, I've felt positively jubilant. You see, my heart's only wish is to become friends with the lovely people of Skyloft. But as you can surely imagine, it's proven quite difficult to break the ice when they are stuck with paralyzing fear at the mere sight of me. That's so sad. I assure you nothing would fill me with my heart with more joy than to be friends with the people of this town. As soon as I try to approach any of them, they get my extent my claw in friendship. They run and scream as though they've seen a walking nightmare. That's kind of scary. Alright, silly me, I've gone ahead of myself. You see, there's an old tale among my monstrous kin that goes as follows. Oh, what is it? Seems that when humans make other humans happy, the happy humans produce a substance known as gratitude crystal. Gratitude crystals are quite amazing. Just looking at them, knowing their gratitude in the world could turn me into a monster into a human. Goodness, nothing would delight me more than become a human. Oh, from that moment, I laid my regrettably demonic eye on you. I could tell you had a gentle and generous heart. Would you please gather gratitude crystals for me and show them to me? Okay, guess we gotta find these gratitude crystals. Okay. Helping people solve their troubles. Okay, well, I mean, I am helping someone solve this trouble, so... With the little girl, so... It's true. Okay, we're gonna get these for him. 
And he's hopefully gonna get something to us. So I guess we gotta get this little girl. So let's grab her. Okay, cool little girl though. You have to like come with me though, because your mom wants you home, so let's go. Ugh, now I have to go freaking find your mom and tell her you're coming home later? Come on, little lady. That's uh, not fair. All right, we'll go tell uh, her mom that we she has been found. How do I get out? Oh, here's the ladder. I was like, how the fetch do I get out of here? Here's the thing, though. Is it gonna be? Oh yeah, it will be. Uh, I was like, is there gonna be room for me to like make it? Perfect. I don't know what that thing is. I always hit it, though. It's probably me, and I probably shouldn't. There's another one of them. Maybe I'm supposed to be friends with it. I don't know. Oh, I don't- I was, like, gonna try to kill him, but I used all my energy. That's why I was like, why isn't my sword coming out? Like, why am I not doing anything? Jeez, the mom's upstairs. Okay, so I probably gotta go up here. I don't know what that guy's doing out of bed, though. Wait, the mom, I think, is... Is she here? No, she's, like, up here. I thought so. Alright, I'm thinking we gotta get and sleep till the morning, so let's do that. And, uh, then I think we have to find the little girl's house, and then, uh, we should get a reward. Alright, let's go f find Kukiel's mom, tell her that she'll be back. I think we can again just go out this exit right here. Oh, wait, that's the headmaster's room. Whoops. Nope. Sorry, bro. Alright, I want to say her house is, like, around here somewhere. Where am I? Oh, dang, I don't need Beacon's place, but I do want to go, like, down around here. So, oh, well, I mean, that's kind of where I'm wanting to go. It's either this one or that one. Is this even a house? Let me see. No. I don't think so then. It must be this one then. Yes, there she is. Freaking Kukiel. Kukiel's safe back at home. It's because of you. Don't not express my gratitude. You can finally smile and laugh again. Thank you so much. And we got a fetching gratitude, Crystal. We got, already got five crystals? Dang. Isn't that like all we needed for what's his name? Sweet. All right, fam. I think we're going to leave it at that. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. Click the bell so you're notified every time we post a new episode of Skyward Sword. And we'll see you next time.